Okay. So here I have the moon pool with my sea moth. I haven't built the cyclone yet. Um, I haven't found all of the specs for it. This is my indoor garden. This is my cafeteria that literally no one can use. <laughs> because no one exists. I just built this for myself, just to feel, you know, not alone. Got these fish in this fish tank. Oh, uh, I didn't show you my captain's quarters. I'll do it now. So here's, I have two like observation domes and I have two because I built this one initially and I liked that it like looked out over this area, but I didn't like that I couldn't see much of the base so I just built another one because I'm like obsessed with my base but also those are my quarters and these doors are super tedious but they like strengthen the hull these are my quarters I stole that what else that's everything that's up here so i built all of these structures i don't have like ladders to them yet so right now they're like those middle ones aren't accessible i intend to build all of that but i just thought that would be really cool for like bunks for crew here is where we saw the cafeteria i walled off half of this and the other side i thought could be used for like <laughs> exercise and activities and then I have an outdoor garden that I use for biofuel um that is not <laughs> I had a brain fart and I thought I was down here this is what I wanted to do yeah okay so where in the hell am I yeah I showed you this cafeteria here's the other end of what that looks like it's literally nothingness where am I in relation to oh yeah that's right it's off the moon pool okay this is my storage this is all my stuff uh, I oh that one's empty I was gonna show you all the resources I had gathered sorry I'm just remembering what the quick keys are so yeah I have like I have a good amount of resources I think that first closet was meant to be titanium but I'm out of titanium because I like used all of it up oh god I've used a lot of resources okay I left myself not a lot to work with oh but I do have a fair amount of food and water oh I was gonna eat that stuff drink drink nom nom and so I think that's what I want I'm gonna go get some stuff oh it's nighttime it's super good means the peepers are out. So right now I'm just gonna... I wish it were darker in here. But I'm day gaming, so... But it does make this dark screen kind of hard to see. Oh, I guess my inventory is full. I guess I can't take him with me. What happens if I just... Okay still alive because I hate like flinging them away and they're dead. I think he's still alive. Oh stop. I want to put this away. My goodness. Yeah, he's alive. I hate killing stuff in this game. I know that sounds so dumb, but like when I hit stuff with my CMOS, I Welcome feel Welcome aboard, Captain. Sad. <laughs> I feel like legitimately sad about it. Oh my god. Okay, just like bear with me on the navigation because this is definitely going to take me a minute. Uh, so I need to break down what I brought in and I like to cure stuff. Cooking fish, it just doesn't last very long. This game isn't new, so I'm sure I'm just explaining things that don't need to be explained. Did I? Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought I cured a bladder fish for a second. And I don't really upgrade my water because like bladder fish are so readily available right here. And it's just more resource gathering when I can literally just gather a ton of bladder fish. I mean, I guess for longer exploration, it would be good. Okay, it's full, which means I can't dump because I don't like to mix. 
my stuff. Wait, this is the titanium thing. I know that for a fact. But what were you? Wait a minute. Oh, crap. Okay, I processed stuff. I have quartz here. For now, I'm just going to put the glass in here as well because you make the glass from the quartz. So that, I'm fine with that logic. And then here's some enameled glass, so that can be in there as well. Gold. I think I have my precious materials. materials rubies and uranianite oh god i really like right before i stopped playing i hella built up my base i don't ah freak my salt's full i don't want to go where the monsters are i don't want to i guess this is just gonna i'm just gonna have to like dive right in i should upgrade my storage what do i have in here okay i have batteries in here Great, and I have my radiation helmet. Great, and I have a couple of first aid kits. What are you, scanner room speed upgrade? Oh, I don't need to carry that. I have gear here. I don't need the habitat builder if I'm exploring. Oh, and I guess I just dumped this stuff in here, even though it's not gear, it's not really an issue. Okay, so I'm gonna grab a bunch of food and water. Okay, I think I'll take these disinfected waters because they'll give me more. And I'll bring one peeper. I just don't want to load up my inventory. So for right now, I'm just going to like... There's usually titanium just like right down here. Let's just... Oh, and I didn't show you... <laughs> I didn't even show you guys my base from the outside. This is my base. I am obsessed with her. Oh, oh, I didn't, I didn't show you the bioreactor. What was I thinking? Okay, let's make sure. Bioreactor appears to have everything it needs. Maybe I could toss one more in there. I mean, I have to remember that you have to like bind different tools. That's the other thing too. I sincerely wish we had more than, I mean, it's, it's small. I love this game. I just wish I had more than five key bindings. Okay, what should we put in there? I don't think it matters. I just need one of those. It's a big boy, I think, yeah. Toss you in there. And so yeah, this powers my base. And I love it because solar panels were kind of killing my resources. And right now, I am at a point where I need to like dive deeper and there's monsters and I'm scared. Honestly, I was having so much fun with this game and I am going to play Sub-Zero after this. Which is like more of the same, but just frozen environment. What? What do I hear? Oh, a creature egg. I don't need it, but I'll look at it. We could scan it. Oh crap, I took it. I don't want that. We're going to drop it. I can scan it if I drop it. Just kidding, it's not scannable. But also, ew. <laughs> I've explored a lot of the wreckage. I found all of the pods there is to find at this point. What, it, what am I hearing? Are those those big things that are not actually scary? I just, there's so many noises in this game. Uh, yeah, those are those big things that aren't scary. I have to get used to the noises again. Okay, I can turn this stuff into titanium. There's some salt. This area is where like the quartz and the salt is. T 
today is just going to be about gathering resources and like getting used to the game again getting used to my base again and the next time i play will be like okay we're gonna go dive and find some scary stuff i don't know if i want to find scary stuff today because this is my first time back in although maybe i do i don't know that's those guys they're harmless I suppose if I was in the Seamoth, I could be going faster. I also have that like, I can't remember what it's called, but it's like the little handheld vehicle. But I kind of don't like it because it takes up so much of your inventory if you're just like out in the world. I don't mind going a little slower. Because if I'm going greater distances, I take the Seamoth. And if I'm not going greater distances, I'm honestly just okay going slower. Oh god. <laughs> what was that? What just got me? What the heck was that? Seriously. Was it down here? I I don't even know what that was. Something got me and I don't know what it was. Okay, well whatever. I guess I like I'm fine take up very much health. Wait, are you telling me my inventory is full? Is that what we're saying? Yep. Alright, back to the base. Yeah, there's a stalker. These guys are a-holes. I like to use my repulsion cannon on them. I built my base in a pretty safe area. The pod that I landed in is just over there. But also like, this is where I, oh, I need oxygen. <laughs> I'm going oxygen. to die. Welcome aboard. Oh, I just like jumped out of the water. Yeah, I built my base in a relatively safe area, but I had gathered so many resources that I had stockpiled in the little floaty containers by my pod that I just didn't want to lug them super far. So it was really easy. Plus, there's a lot of good resources where the creep vines are. Yeah, fuck it, we can make glass. Seek fluid intake. You seek fluid intake. There. Vital signs stabilizing. Excellent. Great. Uh, I have salt. Is this where I keep salt? Where the stink do I keep salt? Here's where I keep salt. I have no room, more room for salt. Salt is going in here. Because actually I use a fair amount of salt. Okay, let's go put the quartz away. Crap. Crap. I'm like full on some stuff and empty on others. Silver ore. Crap. I guess we'll go like that. I guess the copper ore can hang out with the titanium for a hot second, even though I hate it. Uh, okay, gold. Did we? I don't think we have any more room for gold. Frig. Oh, I can move that, I guess. I can go put that with like the gear. What are in you? What are in you? I am good at sentences. Oh, this is just empty. Oh, I might have just been building out my storage the last time I played and not have, like, had plans for some stuff. Why do I have a fire extinguisher in here? Oh, that's right. Oh, you can go there. Okay. Okay. Well, I kind of want to put that stuff in a more obvious place until I have a better system. So I guess this is just like more than gear and mods. <sighs> Which means I need to rename it. Because I can't handle things being mislabeled. <laughs> Alright, lead I can put away. I'm sure this is riveting. Uh, the next one? Uh, this one? Ah, oh, crap. Well, we can go like this, we can go like this, and we can go like this. 
I feel good about that. Okay, so let's grab a couple more of these and let's take the sea moth out. Uh, let's save because I'm probably going to die. I'm like a gaming enthusiast. I'm not a gamer. Like I like games, but I'm not like I'm not good at them. Welcome aboard, Captain. All systems online. Overwatch and Fortnite scare me. I hate playing games with other people because I feel so stupid. Oh, I think I just killed something with my Sima. That sucks. Get out of here. I also upgraded my Seamoth so there's this pulse. Oh shit, <laughs> and I didn't use it. So that's a cool upgrade that I haven't used a whole lot is I can electrocute a hoe if they are messing with me. So I've found a Leviathan over by the Aurora, but I've also found like those alien creatures that teleport. But they mostly don't notice you if you keep your distance. You're pretty cool to stay away from them. There's also a mod where you can co-op this game and I want my boyfriend to play with me, but I do want us to start a new game because I don't want him to touch my base. <laughs> Very particular about this base. Oh, this is something I've never seen before. Oh, I can scan that. Where am I? I've never noticed this before. Seriously? So I'm going to scan this. Because that's what you do with these. You scan them. Or you're supposed to be able to. Can I not? Am I going to die out here? I could scan the other one. Well, frig. So I thought you could scan like all of the alien tech. I don't know. Yep, that's neat. Where's my base? There's my base. So I'm 206 meters east-ish, but then that would be 206 meters west-ish if I'm heading out from my base. Okay, 206 meters, we'll remember that. Probably, probably not actually. It's already gone from my brain. Like, I kind of want to stay in the Seamoth. These guys are more obnoxious than scary. They make me think of cockroaches. Oh no, I killed a peeper! Is he dead? Oh, I might not have hit him hard enough for him to be dead. I like, I hate that so much. Oh my god, stop! It's like they want to die. Oh, sweet mother of pearl, it's a leviathan. Well, okay. I already saved. We should just stay here. I should charge up my thinger. It is a leviathan. I am going to go toward it. But it's like phasing in and out of the ground. Is there like a... Okay, I'm going to go toward it because content. So I guess I must not have been here before. You're like ugly. Do you like know that? Um, sure. How is he not noticing that I'm here? Hi. Hello. Can you please notice me? I need validation and attention. Seriously? Oh god, he noticed me. <laughs> I think he noticed me. No, he didn't. What? Is this a glitch? I'm gonna follow him. We're gonna die. I'm gonna save. <laughs> no! <laughs> okay, so so that does seem to deter him because he kind of like latched on. That makes me feel good because there's leviathans over by the aurora. He's just like phasing in and out. 
Oh, see? Okay, so these guys I know as well. Um, hello? Sure. He noticed me. Ah, he noticed me! He noticed me too! Ah! <laughs> Get to the surface! I need to go back to my base because that like busted up my demoth really good. Oh my god, you guys, I'm so dumb. Before I said I was 200, oh, I was 206 meters from the surface, not 206 meters from my base. How did I get over here into the Leviathan fields? Where even am I? I've done blind ex exploration before and I've never wound up so like out of touch with reality. Oh well, I need to, did I bring my repair tool with me? I sure did. We're gonna jump out and fix that once we get a little closer to base. Cause I kinda wanna go back there. I kinda wanna go back there. Oh, frickin' McFrick. Let me out. Okay. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you. I don't want to go all the way back to base. I still have 87% power. <sighs> what would I do at base? Literally nothing. I just nommed on some food. Let's go back. I remember I was like west-ish. Oops. He's dead for sure. Yeah. Look at him floating. He's dead. I killed him. Poor guy. So. This is where we were before. Because I remember those two things. Okay, cool. Thanks. So that's that vent. So there's... So 965 meters. Okay. 206 was my depth. I'm dumb. Hi, I'm dumb. We're headed due west. There's the Leviathan, and we are 1,090 meters from home. Okay, so there's lots of stuff over here, so we're probably going to die. I just kind of want to see how far I can go. What the frig are those? Oh crap, those are alive things. Those probably are not good news. Oh, I just saved, so I should go investigate. I don't want to, I'm scared. What are you? Um, friend or foe? Are they walking along the surf, the sea floor? They are. Okay, so now I am 1321 West. What is this? I haven't seen these yet. These are new. I wonder if they'll hurt me. But it's the daddy, the mama, and the baby. I'm afraid of being here. Based on their movements, I feel like they're not evil. Damage to plant life on the seafloor suggests this may be the migration path of a huge bottom dwelling life form. Oh, thank you. So maybe these guys just migrate and they won't hurt me, so I'm gonna keep going. But they're neat. And they're loud. Oh, please don't make those sounds. Please don't. You guys have weird butts. Okay, maybe I should try to build the Cyclops. Or the... Maybe I should try to, like, not do this in a sea moth. We are very far away. Let's 
first of all, let's go higher and be on the surface. I can't remember what my depth is. I know I upgraded my depth, but I don't know. I'm like maxed out on my Seamoth depth, but I don't remember. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, excuse me. <laughs> Stupid. I don't remember what the max depth is. I think it's a thousand. I just want to drink this coffee, but this microphone's in the way. Well, it's nighttime. You guys want to see some nighttime? See the aurora? aurora. radio in here, so I don't know why I would be picking up on anything. Alright, let's park this bad boy. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thanks. Super happy to be here. check to see what what the heck do I want to do here what was I doing I came back for a reason do you guys remember I don't remember boop, boop, boop. I guess I'll put the salt there even though it doesn't go there I guess I'll drink this water I guess I'll eat these fish or one fish uh okay I need to remember Let's, okay, we have to check the radio. I don't think I put a radio in this room. I think I put a radio in the sea, in the moon pool. Okay, and there's nothing coming through on it. Okay, so like what are my next? Yeah, 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 I saw that. Endorphin levels, <laughs> Uh, Okay, I guess I could go back on, try to go to the other side of the Aurora. What do I need for... <sighs> There's stuff I haven't discovered yet. So I can't build the... Pr like the prawn suit. Because I can't... I've, I've made everything except for aerogel. And aerogel... Maybe I'll pin that and we'll try to like... Wait. Wait. I have both those things. I have a gel sack. And I have rubies. I'm like... Fl okay. Uh, uh, I'm like flush with rubies. Is that really? Do I? I think I have a gel sack. Didn't you guys see a gel sack? <laughs> Not in there. Not in there. That's just a ton of diamonds. No, 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 no. I had a gel sack. Didn't I have like a bio storage? Oh, I found a gel sack. <laughs> okay. And I have rubies. I have rubies for friggin' days, yo. Let's make some arrow gel. Let's make some arrow gel. Oh my god, arrow gel. Okay. Alright. And I need a plasteel ingot, which I think I already have. Not in there. Yup. Did I just need the one? Oh my god, if I can build a prawn suit, I am going to be like so jazzed. I have diamonds, I have lead, I, I, oh crap, no I have, <laughs> I have everything I need. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Oh my god. It's going to take me a minute to like, I wish you could label these lockers, like you can hang signs but only on walls and it would be really helpful if you could like drop signs onto the actual lockers, developers. Hint, hint. If you are going to upgrade this game, I highly suggest that. Oh, for frick's sake. Was it this one? Yes. Okay. So we're going to make another aerogel. And I need enameled glass. And diamonds and lead. Oh my god. I'm just, oh my god, you guys. Wait. 
What is happening? I have, I have, oh, I don't have the ruby. <laughs> and while I'm over here, I may as well get the lead. Do I just need the one lead? No, I need two leads and two diamonds. So I need, oh my God, I need another lead. And two diamonds. Remember how I said I was flush with diamonds? Oh, Frickin' A, that's the gold. One, two. Okay, let's build a prawn suit and go eat some prawns. Oh yeah, I think I build it up here. Okay, where do I build a prawn suit? In the vehicle bay? Prawn suit. The pressure reactive waterproof nano suit is a range of mechs designed to protect the pilot from extreme environments. Okay, this is what I want to be exploring in. Powerful hydraulic limbs allow for manipulation of objects and powered traversal of the environment. Rear mounted thrusters provide maneuverability in low gravity environment. A range of modifications are available. The prawn suit, it's got you covered. But is the prawn suit better than the sea moth? The sea moth is just a vehicle. The prawn suit you can like, you don't have to get out of it to gather resources. Plus it has defensive capabilities. Like the Cyclops is the, the dream, but we're not there yet. So I think I need to build this at my mobile vehicle bay, which I do have. It's outside. Up. Oh. <laughs> it's just up. Where did I put that thing? I put it up here. Like it is. Or is it more over toward my pod? Oh, it's right there. Hey! Whoa, I am a fast swimmer. Hey guys. Um, prawn suit! It is normal when first piloting a prawn suit to feel a sense of limitless power. Prawn operators receive weeks of training to counteract this phenomenon. You will have to make do with self-discipline. That's great. That sounds like something I'm not going to do. Does that mean it's going to, like, deplete my resources more? Um, excuse me. Excuse me. Can you not crash to the bottom of the seafloor? Welcome to board, Captain. Thanks. Oh, ho, ho. What's this? What is that? Are those my arms? <sighs> nom, 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 nom. Oh, can I only wait? Okay. Okay, so I can store my prawn suit here. Cool. Weird and cool. Okay. Um, nom. Okay. I feel like this is a good place to stop. I will come back. Save. I will come back. We will explore with the prawn suit. I want to know what that's all about. This was this was kind of clunky, but it was mostly just like an introduction to get me back into the game. I'm going to pause here. I'm going to come back and we're going to try out the prawn suit. Great. 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 It's going to be great. Good things are happening. Okay. Bye. That was weird.